because this is all an epic fail. My life's falling apart. Is it on? Mm hmm. Yeah. It's going. It's happening, ladies and gentlemen. As you can see, we have stuff galore everywhere. Got something new. A little pitter action. Things tough. We sold the. Uh, is that real? That's real. Press target? Yeah. No, it's not real. No. But nobody needs it now. Nobody needs it now, man. No. That looks real. I it wouldn't even worry real. about it. That's what I mean. Looks fine. We uh, sold the 125. That's gone. So now we're down to this. Cut. But we have some mischievous parts that came in. We're going to toss them on this thing real quick. <clears throat> and honestly, I don't see myself doing much else to it after this. It sounded good on paper, but that's about it. So we have what? Bars to do, new chain, sprockets, grips, and a front tire. And that's about it. And just change the oil in it. Probably get a set of pegs. I was going to say, you need the pegs. Pegs are a little worn. And slap some graphics on there, but I'm not doing anything else extravagant. Because I'm about to pitter life. It's 95% more fun. Full pitter now? Yes. So, yeah, this one's about to die. Are you serious? <laughs> They're all probably dead then. Oh well. Yo, KX250 has a whopping 69 hours on her. That way, 69. It's possible. It's not factual. I thought you were just taking them whole things off. Huh? Why wouldn't you just take the whole back? I need off? the bolts still, dude. No, you don't. Oh yeah, you're right. No, I don't. True, true, true. <laughs> true, true, true. We're gonna find what size that Johnny. Nice and tight up in there. What do you think about that? Wouldn't be, wouldn't be a project if it wasn't impossible. Gosh. Nice, dude. I love when they just can't make, like who? I think your best bet is probably socket, dude. There's no way you're getting a socket on there, dude. Yeah, I think, dude. Try to get that wrench up in there. I don't think it's gonna happen. There's just not enough room. Hmm. How do you think they do it? How the pros do it? Everything just falls apart today. What a sad day it'll be. Just nothing, nothing's working today. Just one of those days where just everything's going against me. Nothing was just ever taken care of. Just stuffed in a barn its whole life. Yeah. Rode hard, put up dry. Not even wet, it was just dry. You're gonna take care of her? No. Yeah, that's a good I'm not even changed, I haven't even changed the oil in this yet. It's got a fresh oil. Does it actually? No, I don't know. Let me be honest. What? This thing might not have an oil change since the motor got rebuilt. Probably not. Like, probably not, honestly. I don't remember. I don't think it has, actually. That needs done. Wanna know something funny? What? Raises at 40 hours, oil was supposed to get changed at 25 off the off the break-in startup. Nah, that's different, right? You think it'll be alright? Yes. Yeah, I think so. I'm about to just do this tomorrow. What do you want to do today? I don't even know. I'm just like done. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. I get what you're saying, dude. Like, I don't know. I just don't. We'll put the handlebars on. I'm not doing anything else. <laughs> what do you got going on? I don't even know at this point, dude. I've never had this happen in my life. Perch bolt just oh, snapped in there, dude. Hold on, hold on. She's like crazy. There we go. Look at that. Clean snap in there, too. Cleaned her, cleaned her right off. I don't even know how. Where's that? Oh, yeah. I don't even know how, man. In all my years, that's never happened to me. I'm out once. Shoot her. So you boys know how drilling usually goes. Let's see if it works. What happened? Still looking good in there? Break it? The issue is that this is a wood thing. A wood bit going in there? Yeah. I'd say get in there though. I think I'm gonna snap it. No. No, I think you're just tight in there. I don't know if this drill job's gonna work. It's not straight. Oh, oh. 
All right, welcome back, JDs and Littlemen. And we're back again with another video here of the Kawasaki. And I'm not even too sure where I left off with this. I have no clue. I just remember being super frustrated because nothing was going correctly. So we're going to make this short and sweet and uh, show you that everything has been complete almost with this. Um, we had one heck of a time getting some of these parts on and in because I was sent the wrong stuff originally which was no good this was no good and so much stuff has even happened in the past couple weeks between me starting to film this stuff that's just been hectic um, i have not wanted to film a single thing because it's just been chaos a couple things happened uh obviously we got some new parts in um my truck got totaled so that's been super fun and uh trying to do all this stuff with the insurance and it's been a weeks and weeks process unfortunately and I'm left without a truck currently as we upload this. So, um, yeah, there's that. So hopefully all it's all finalized by the time this is uploaded, but we'll see. So let's just go over the bike. Let's just jump into this. Should be a super short and sweet video here. Yeah, let's just dive into it. I'll go over what the heck we got in and, you know, simple parts. And hopefully we can get out and go riding here soon. So let's check it. All right, so last time you guys saw this, um, we were trying to get the clutch lever on here and uh, we stripped a bolt in there so we had to get a new perch had to end up ordering new levers because motorsport sent me the wrong one somehow don't ask me how so new clutch lever new brake lever new perch uh obviously new grips are on there rental limited edition bars which looks sweet with like this i don't even know what color you want to call that it's like sort of gold um odi lock-ons um nothing really crazy though back end move to the back here um acer beast a chair beast however you want to pronounce it hook this up um the rider program here got the new chain guard chain guide in the back uh rental sprockets for the rear and the front and then we got an arcade gold chain on here as well um i was gonna order new plastics and stuff but it's really senseless for me to do that oh these plastics are in tip-top shape but take a water break it's hot um but yeah that's really it honestly we're gonna rip these number plate decals off and then put some graphics on real quick and then probably honestly need to get some new bolts for this because they're pretty ugly looking on here um, but other than that, the only thing we really need to do, got to get a fresh tire, which I have in the back. Just haven't had time to do it or anything. Take the front apart, grease everything, change the oil, change the filter up. And then she'll be good to go for some riding here soon. So just a quick little update there. Like I said, I'm not too sure how much else has been in this. So maybe I'll set the camera up while we do some graphics here, but, uh, 180 hooking us up with the graphics. All right, so we just got done with the graphic kit on here. And I think honestly, the last thing I have to do is get a new air filter, front tire, maybe get a new back tire too. I'm not sure, but uh, this thing looks pretty sweet. And uh, let's just do a quick glance at it. It looks pretty sick. Shout out 180 decals. He hooked me up big time with this stuff. So. That was scary. Uh, he hooked me up big time with some graphics. Uh, I've always used him in the past. Stuff fits awesome. It's easy to bend around. Um, I got some bubbles in mine, but that's just because I cheaped out on not buying plastic. But uh, the stuff's super easy to fold around and everything. Very minimal bubbles. Uh, but it looks great. Check him out. 180decals.com. Uh, he's always having some promotions and stuff. But it's probably the coolest graphic kits that stand apart. You can get some factory looking stuff. You can get some custom stuff. You can get anything you want done. It uh, looks pretty, pretty sick. So let's check it.
JD's and Little Man. I hope you guys are enjoying your 2023 so far. Uh, everything's been chaotic on my end, but we're pushing through it. And uh, hopefully, hopefully, the subscribers have been climbing somehow. I don't know how, but we're up to like 445 or something already now. So remember, 1,000 subscribers, keep smashing it. We'll do a camera giveaway of some sort. You know, maybe a little bit of merch is when we'll start dropping some merchandise, some t-shirts and stickers. Uh, so keep smashing the subscribe button and uh, we will see you guys in the next video. Hopefully it's a cool video. And that's that. Thanks for tuning in. See you all in the next one.